running Geekbench. So we can get a better example of how loud this thing is. Let's go around the box. Yeah, this thing is specced out with a um, Pentium D920, um, two gigabytes of DDR2 675, um, four five or twelve megabyte sticks of Corsair XMS. Um, it's got a, a uh, light on DVD ROM and a Memorex 52 re or wait, 52 times right. 24 times rewrite, 52 times read, disk drive. Um, got 64 gig SSD in here. A small Samsung one. My god, that's loud. Noise cancellation is really good on the Galaxy Note camera, so I don't know if you can hear this, but I feel like I can't even talk over it. Um, USB ports up front here are actually broken stuff is snapped off in them. This is a previously owned computer. Um, I was the original owner of it. Oh dear. Why wow, that's quite loud. There's only one um, one vent right here for the intake. That's not including the one down there for the hard drives because there's not even a fan in there. This is the one fan cooling like almost the entire system. The other one being the I have the graphics card fan if applicable and mine doesn't have one. I have the ATI Radeon X600 um, and it's a discrete one with only 128 um, megabytes of video RAM, so it doesn't have a fan on the heatsink. The only other fan in the whole computer is the power supply fan, which rarely, if ever, spins up. Um, I was originally running Mac OS 10.5.8 on here because uh, this has the onboard Intel. Graphics Media Accelerator 950 chipset on it, allowing you to pretty much run anything up to Mac OS 10.6.8. Um, not very well, though. It's the Pentium D only counts as a core duo when you're hackintoshing, so you can't really do a bunch of things. And, ooh, that's not good. Geekbench has crashed. Darn. Guess we'll never know the results. Oh well. Or maybe we will. That was silly. Okay, 2064. That's like nothing. But then again, this is 32-bit Windows. Pentium 4 based dual-core processor. There it is. Smithfield. Uh, Intel i945 motherboard. Uh, rather old Dell BIOS on here. Oh, this is a Dell Dimension E510, by the way. I'll have to run this on my desktop eventually when I get arsed into buying an SSD or a, or a 600 gig Velociraptor or something for it. Anyway, back to this. I just had this on so I could play around with it. Back to work. Thanks for watching.